WFNN. Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here on this 20th day of October, uh, 11 o'clock, uh, sorry, 10 o'clock, Tiger Financial News Network market update. We're looking at the Dow, 35,545, up 90 points. It is within, what, 76 or something points of an all-time high. Really good action. Uh, a nice cup formation breaking out of that, over that resistance level. Uh, this is uh, one, two, three, four, five. This could be the fifth uh, green session that we've had in a row. We'll see. Days young. I think we, we're getting a little bit uh, um, overbought in a certain sense. Just near term. We'll see what happens. Looking at the S&P, also a very nice day so far. It's in leg C as well, like the Dow. At 45.28, it's got a lot more to go to get to the 45.46 level for an all-time high. Uh, good action so far. The QQQ, this is the NDX 100. Struggling is down 22 cents at 375.27. Uh, it's a good catch-up, but I think it's going to be lagging those two key indices. We're looking at the IWM, the Russell 2000, small caps, up three cents, really struggling in the middle of its range, not breaking down, not breaking out. What's really interesting here is if you look at Bitcoin, we were discussing it when I did my webinar last night. I, I discussed it as well, that Bitcoin is acting very well. Bitcoin actually is at 66,620. All-time high was 66,310. Uh, All-time high. And it's in leg D. Finally, you've got that leg D in the monthly chart. And uh, as I say, we, we've been following that. We're still long, a small position, very small position after being long from the 12,000s. Okay, we're looking at the uh, gold. Gold right now is uh, up about eight points. It's in that range. It's doing quite nicely. It's holding well. It's not breaking out upside or downside. It's just sideways. What's really going to be important here is crude oil. Crude oil, we're anticipating that there's some kind of a peak D pullback, very minor pullback in the in the daily chart that could unfold in the next few days. But if it suddenly sl slides from 81 uh, to the 78 area in the next two days, then it's going to have a, that pullback, in fact, could be very important. I'll be back in a few moments for the Tiger Technicians Hour. I hope you can stay. Check out my opening call, my daily newsletter, and we'll see you very soon. Otherwise, tomorrow, same time, same station. Thanks.